Welcome to Simply Apple. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to set up a screensaver with Mac OS X. To begin, open System Preferences. There are a variety of ways to do this, but for this video, I'm going to select the Apple logo in the upper left corner of the menu bar. Within the Apple logo menu, select System Preferences. And then within the System Preferences window, select Desktop and Screensaver. Within the Desktop and Screensaver window, click on the tab labeled Screensaver. In this video, I am using OS X Lion, and you can now see some of the default screensavers that come with Lion. Simply select a screensaver by clicking on it, and its preview will appear in the area labeled Preview. And again, simply select a screensaver in the middle left column, and view the preview in the middle right column of the window. It should also be noted that a screensaver will not appear until your computer has been idle for a set time. To set that time, move the slider in the area marked Start Screensaver to the length of time your computer is to be idle before the screensaver starts. Some screensavers can also be customized. If the Options button is grayed out, that screensaver cannot be customized. However, if the Options button is active, click on that button to further adjust features of the screensaver similar to what I'm currently doing on the screen. And when you make your selection, hit OK. And as you can tell, the screensaver has changed its options slightly. Next to the Options button, you will also see the Test button, which will allow you to preview the screensaver in full screen. In addition, you can also further adjust the screensaver by selecting some checkboxes in the lower left corner of the Desktop and Screensaver window. For this example, I'm going to go ahead and check the box next to where it says Show with Clock. And when I click the Test button to view the screensaver full screen, you will see the clock also appears as well. We also have the options to use random screensavers by simply checking that checkbox. And we can also make our screensaver only appear on our main screen if we're using multiple screens. Furthermore, we also have some hot corner options, which will be further explained and future Simply Apple videos. I should also say that at any time you want to exit a screensaver, simply press any key on your keyboard or move your mouse to exit the screensaver. Well, there you have it. Setting up a screensaver with Mac OS X. And until next time, this is Simply Apple.